If you are living, you are losing. Because with life comes loss. And that being said, losing is a life skill. We teach kids a lot of things. I have two kids. We practice multiplication. We practice algebra, geometry, where to put a comma, where to put a period. We teach a lot of those things, which are important. But if you can't lose, the way you handle loss, no matter what kind of loss, whether that's failing a test, whether that's the impact of losing someone to suicide, or my story, all of the above, I've lost a lot of things in my life. And the way I handled that loss has led me to today. We speak of post-traumatic growth as it, as if it's something to mark off the list like a check checkbox, but really it's a life skill. Being able to ask for help, life skill. Being able to admit I have a problem, life skill. Being able to say no, quit my job, to focus on myself and my kids, life skill. And all of that led me to post-traumatic growth. So losing is something we need to be teaching, not protecting our children from. They need to learn to bounce, bounce back after losing a game or failing an algebra test or not making the volleyball team or not making the state championship. Losing is a life skill. And life will be a whole lot easier if we teach them when the loss is little versus when they're 38 and lose their husband to suicide. Losing is something we need to be teaching. Life skills, like losing, is something we need to be teaching.